Hello, this is Nick from Laptop Media, and today we will show you how to open the HP EliteBook 640G11. To open this business machine, you have to undo just five captive Phillips head screws. Pop the areas behind the hinge cover near the top two edges with a lever tool. Lift the middle as well. The next step is to pry the sides and the front. The device in front of us has the optional 56 watt hour battery. The default version is a 48 watt hour variant. To remove it, detach the connector by pulling it towards the unit and open the two latches on the bottom. Raise up the lower side of the unit by holding the two tabs and lift the battery away from the chassis. The capacity is enough for around 10 hours and a half of video playback. Our test was conducted with the Battery Saver preset activated in the Windows Power and Battery menu. The replaceable Wi-Fi 6E card is on the right of the cooling. The RAM section has a metal shield on top which can be popped with a lever tool. According to HP, the two memory slots are compatible with up to 64 gigabytes of DDR5, 5,600 megahertz RAM in dual channel mode. However, since the CPU can support up to 96 gigabytes, this laptop likely wouldn't have issues running a larger amount of memory than the official manufacturer's specified limit. There is a long thermal pad in front of each memory slot for additional cooling. Sadly, you get just one 2280 Gen 4 M.2 slot for storage expansion. The cooling features one large fan, a long, thick heat pipe, one heat sink, and a heat spreader. 